Speaking of friends, though, let's go ahead and bring in uh, Tayana this morning from Taste and See Tampa Bay. As we mentioned, she is taking us to a winery. I I'm telling it's a great five year celebration uh, piece to do. <laughs> like I got coffee. I was going to say, coffee, wine. I should have prepared. There's even coffee, wine at this place. So best of both worlds right there. You could cheers with both. <laughs> Wait a second. Coffee, wine, what? Exactly. There's a lot of unique flavors at Bunker Hill Vineyard and Winery. We took a ride out there to Manatee County in a 2021 Mazda CX-5 to check out America's greenest winery. Everything that they have there, the wine bottles, the corks, the wax that goes on the bottles is completely recyclable and reusable. Everyone. Today, we're hitting the road in a beautiful 2021 Mazda CX-5 from Mazda of Wesley Chapel. This car is both maneuverable and easy to drive thanks to a Sky Active 2.5 liter turbo engine and active driver display. Plus, keyless entry makes for a great touch, especially when you're in a rush. Today, we're hitting up America's greenest winery. Everything from the wine bottles to the corks to even the wax is completely recyclable. everyone, we've made it to Parrish, Florida to check out Bunker Hill Vineyard and Winery, which is all about sustainability. So not only can you try some really unique off the wall flavors of unfiltered wine, but you can also learn about everything this winery is doing to stay green. You won't just see grape wines here. You're gonna see cherry tomato wines. You're gonna see dandelion flower petal wines, jalapeno wines strawberry wines, cucumber wines, coffee, tea wines, we're the only winery in America that makes both of those. But you're going to see a plethora of wines that I think we're making currently about 40 different wines. When you get here, you would be able to select five wines. You're going to get six, however. We pick one and then um, you just enjoy yourself is really what it is. It will answer any questions that you might have about anything we do here or about wines in general. When they finish their wine tasting, they can also walk over to the Jams Marmalade Preserves and say, I'd like to taste this one and we'll have a sample of that too. If you were to pick up any of our wine bottles, you would see right on the front label the word unfiltered. Uh, what it means though is that nothing has been taken out of your wines. Our taste flavor bouquet of, of our wines, because they're unfiltered, they come from the fruit or vegetable that they're made from. This also makes them palatable to the vegans and vegetarians. They can't drink the other wines in the marketplace because those are filtered through animal byproducts. We started out from day one, had decided that we would produce our wines in a green, sustainable way. And that's what we do here. We try to convey to the consumer not only a great time when they're here, but also to instill in them some knowledge that they can carry with them. We've been open to the public now 12 years, and in this entire 12 years, we've never, ever purchased a single wine bottle. Every one of those came from our customers. We clean and sanitize them, put them back into circulation. Inside every bottle is a natural cork. We take your cork back. We'd send them to a company that will actually convert those into cork floor tiles. Now on the top of every wine bottle, they're dipped into hot sealing wax. We take that back too at the end of the day. So our consumers go home, they enjoy the wines, they bring the bottles, the wax, and the corks back. Everything comes back. Nothing has the opportunity to go to a landfill. The wax will remelt and add that to another wine bottle the next time we bottle. People should come here basically because they're gonna have an experience like no other. I mean, this is not just a wine tasting, this is an experience. They really are wholesome wines, and it's something that I think if you can try, you're gonna be amazed at what you've been missing. All right, and of course, you can't stop by here and not take some wine home. Well, something really interesting I learned here is that because these wines are unfiltered, they're actually good for around 20 years, which is pretty amazing because most wine bottles do not last that long. Well, let's hit the road so I can get home and enjoy these.
really cool about Bunker Hill Vineyard and Winery is that they actually produce 97% of their uh, wines from Florida grown commodities. So they're all about Florida agriculture on top of everything else. <laughs> Nice. That's awesome. And you walked away with the case. I love <laughs> seeing that. You know, I was going to, I had to point that out. Good for you, Tayana. You were talking about how you really did enjoy. You know, I just heard recently that they were saying in France, wines are actually maybe limited a little bit because of cold temperatures. Mm -hmm. Who needs French wines when you've got wines right here? You yeah. Can Florida produce, right? Exactly. Unfiltered wines last around 20 years when most wines usually oh, last wow. around like five. It's, it's an amazing spot to check out. Wow. Thanks. All right. On the to-do list. Nat. Cheers <laughs> to you. And I promise this really is coffee, not coffee wine in my coffee <laughs> glass, but that is sound cool anyways. Thanks, Diana, Diana. Always so good to see you. We know people can check out a lot more and taste and see Tampa Bay as well. Exactly. Thanks for having me.